What is up, everybody? Got a couple of peace dollars to show you today. A 21 high relief and a 22D, both in uh, MS65. A couple of pickups from early last year. The 22D, once you get into the gem, is actually a pretty tough coin. Same thing with the 21. I mean, those are just tough all around. Um, this one is uh, in an ICG holder, and I paid uh, MS63 price for it, right around uh, 500 bucks. Um, this thing was in a PCGS holder. This is a, a $12 to $1,500 coin. I was looking at other uh, 21 examples. I thought, well, things thing seems pretty flatly struck for us for a 65 but when I was looking at all the other ones uh, for sale they all they're all flatly struck like that at least on the hairline the rest of the coins actually seems to be struck up pretty nice but yeah you can really tell on the hairline it seems kind of flat luster on this coin is decent um, got a little bit of toning Right there in America and uh, on the obverse or on the rim a little bit down by the date. Overall, pretty nice coin. Um, I think I seen a couple other uh, 21 piece uh, ICG holders, and those people they wanted like 800 bucks for them, but. I think we all know that's probably a little high, but at, at 500, I think it was a good deal. Uh, this next one I got here is a 22D in a PCGS holder. Luster on this coin is really nice. Uh, and I think that's really how they grade these mostly is by the luster on them. A little bit more so than they do with the Morgans. Uh, Peace dollars are really hard to grade. This thing does have a um, little bit of chatter on it, not bad. But like I was saying, it has really good luster. That's why they called this coin a gem. That little tiny mint mark. If we get a little closer look at it. A little tick right in front of the eagle's face and right above its head. Um, I mean, not bad though. There's maybe a couple of marks, a couple little marks in the obverse. Really blast white coin. I'm more into the toners, but I don't mind having some blast white coins, especially with peace dollars. They're so they're so tough to find nice toned ones. I'm not really sure why that is. I think the uh, metal composition is just a little bit different uh, starting in 21. They changed it up a little bit and that, whatever they added to it with the silver uh, caused them to not tone as much. Take us a little closer look at this one. Here you can see the hair, how flatly struck it is. pretty good pretty good luster to it still I have this one out of 64 not quite as overgraded as some of the ICGs are you know so at a at 64 it would be like a $750 coin so you know hard to say if I did good on it or not uh, but anyways just wanted to show you a couple more Peace dollars for my set that I'm putting together. I got a, a 22S in uh, 64 and a 2060 that I want to show you guys here too. So, anyways, uh, take care and have a good day.